I don't know what I want to do. I'm afraid about life. I'm worried about what would happen if I let myself feel again. And I feel like I don't deserve happiness. I'm just not capable of doing anything meaningful. And I worry, I really worry about what people think of me. But here I am, taking a leap of faith, ready to commit to a new chapter in my life, a chapter where I will focus on myself and I will allow myself to unload some issues. My job title is a team leader for the Prince's Trust. But when I interview my students, I like to be called a coach. And the reason why is because as a coach, you're not here to be liked, you're here to be respected. And if I'm respected, then I can actually be a little bit more tougher on the individuals as they're trying to learn new skills. My job is to locate students who have fallen through the net. They could be educational underachievers. It could be people who have come into problems with the law. It could be from the point of view where they may have other conditions. It could be sometimes mental illness. So I will interview each individual student and what I try to do is put a quite diverse team and I try to find the people who meet the criteria of what the Prince's Trust is looking for for their students. It's no point in me having a, a grade A students because that's not what the course is about. It's there to help new people or old people get new skills. I choose the Princess Trust because um, I would like to improve myself and Donovan it told me like um, and I can improve here <laughs> and like learn like spread how to express myself because I, I was telling you that I, English is not my first language, so um, this, this course is going to help me to um, give me the vocabulary and grammar to speak English in a friendly manner. And that's <laughs> Uh, I decided to send to the Princess Chess course because uh, to to help my uh, to help my language to improve more my co communication uh, and especially my confidence because I wasn't I wasn't a confident guy before I started this course I was I was really really shy I would. I couldn't even go to the market without dressing good and um due to due to have having problems i've been trying to get back on my feet i've been home restricted for um pretty much about a year yeah doing nothing apart from staying at home i was at a situation i was at a state where the only people i felt like i could rely on was my family Due, due to due to anxiety problems, I, I've had a rough five five or so years. Try try my best to stabilize my confidence after experiences personal experiences at secondary school. Um, I do feel like this program has helped me, considering it offered help to those with anxiety, anxiety and personal issues in life. So I thought that this would be a good place to stand my ground, to really help me get back onto my feet, begin to build a level of trust for other people again. Um, so far it's been good. I've been able to open up a bit more, been able to open up to people, talk, talk to people once again. The class has been very supportive so far, making sure I'm not left down and on, on my feet. I, I do finally feel like I'm beginning to regain my confidence from the course. Um, s slow pace but very steady at the same time. So I'm, I'm fortunate in that way. I'm happy to have gotten it. For, for a change, I, I, I haven't 
I haven't really been doing counselling. Normally that's something that I need, but I've been I've been quite sta stabilised and steady in the environment. I feel like this is going to help me, you know, financially in the future, help me push me push me towards my goals. I've already felt that as we plan as we planned out. Um, I'm I'm someone who's been unsure of where, where to go, what to do next with life. Um, at the moment, there have been some very interest, interesting parts of the course, really, um, such as teaching us CPR medical techniques to go on our CV, and um, I managed to pass that. I was I was very fortunate and pleased. So, educate education so far is really progressing. Many different vari varieties of styles to help out. I really feel like this course, this course although, although I'm still unsure of where to go next, uh, I feel like I'll be pushed forward and have goals, things to really help me, boost, boost me towards a career later in life, or even maybe a university or extra college course place. Oh, I did originally apply for a different course, and I was really struggling with my anxiety, and I wasn't able to um, actually go into the class because it got a bit too much for me. Um, and I was sitting outside on the bench just reading my book because I couldn't go in. And um, Donovan, our team leader, came up to me. He was like, can I talk to you for a bit? I was like, OK. And um, he explained what the Prince's Trust was. And um, I'm going to be honest, at first I didn't know if it would make any change or like um, improve like my social skills and that kind of stuff. Because I've done stuff like that before and it hasn't really worked out for me. Um, but even though I started a week late, everyone was so welcoming and it was so easy to like be around everyone. And I settled in quite early on, which is unusual for me. <laughs> Our project involves bike safety, making sure to keep a helmet on. As we know, there have been many injuries, um, fatalities on the road. So in, in order to help help that, we, we've decided to start a charity over it. We've already done a few projects. Um, we've recently done our first mon money fundraising project with Sweets. Um, in other words, we bought, we bought a, a big, big packet of Sweets and ended up putting them into a jar, giving, giving people a chance to, to guess how many they think are in the jar. Um, 50p a guess. And that, that did very well. And what I could, I could um, help you with is, if, if, is that going to be your, your poster as well? Is that um, going to be your poster? Yeah, I was thinking that could be our po just our campaign poster. Yeah. I know um, Yaz made another poster, but I thought that could be not a campaign poster, that could be information poster. Because we need something that's eye-catching and iconic for a, a poster campaign. Dynamics. 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 Dynam
and after 12 weeks, you see how much they've grown. I could, I could choose individuals, but I think that wouldn't be appropriate. I think what's the best moment is in week 12, and you can look at each person in the eye, and you can see how much their confidence has grown, how much their skill set has grown, and it is a beautiful feeling to have watching people up on stage talking about their journeys, as everybody's got a journey. One of my highlights is my timekeeping, which, which I am like uh, the earliest in the class every day. And like, uh, I'll, con I'll consider this thing as a highlight because like, I've never been feeling like that before, like my confidence, my confidence is, has improved a lot since I have been the Princess Chess course, Princess Chess here. Okay, so I really enjoy being around these people, like making friends has been one of the most like amazing highlights. Like, they're all so understanding and really, like, really easy to get along with. And uh, we all just kind of click in a way. Like, there's no, like, conflict yet. <laughs> um, we have our ups and downs, but at the end of the day, we all, like, work as a team. Like, we have each other's backs. And I like that. I think one of my highlights in this course was like when we are doing like the activities I think that's really comfortable to me because uh, we're making new friends and we're learning well, I learn I am learning new things new vocabulary and I think that's really good Things that seemed so meaningful before were actually meaningless. My team leaders kept telling me along the program, what you put in is what you get out. I understand this now. This program would have taught me a life lesson. I am now worried about a set of all new different things. I worry about not remembering these moments of little successes, all the support and attention I was given all the places I was opening doors to. I allowed myself to open up, to open my heart to the many possibilities in life. It gives you a different perspective to conquer challenges in life. Knowing you are not alone, facing your own demands is a good start. That you are now part of a large community. I feel that it is okay not to be in control all the time. An adventure is a way to discover more about yourself and what you are really passionate about. This is my thank you to you, to believe in me, and it is priceless.